Hey, how you guys doing? This is the producer from Brothers Comics. I am at Comic Con Revolution in West Palm Beach. I am here with artist extraordinaire uh, Greg Lane. <laughs> Mr. Lane, how are you? I'm uh, doing good. Doing hey, good. Uh, I know you got a couple of commissions that we won't take up too much of your time. Um, what can you tell me about your role in the new Marvel Refresh? Um, Right now, I've been doing some covers. Uh, I finished up my run on uh, Incredible Hulk uh, last month. So I'm doing covers before I start my next project. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be Astonishing X. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. I, I think I think I'm allowed to say that. Okay, excellent. Not 100% sure, but. <laughs> breaking news. It's out there now. Yeah, breaking news, everybody. I'm from Brothers Comics. Excellent. Uh, so. What's your favorite part about the, uh, the cons? You know, I know you get to do the conditions and whatnot. What's generally your favorite part? Well, it, you know, it's always fun to be able to interact with folks, you know, get a chit chat with people. And, yeah. You know, because like I work at home, so I, I really don't have much interaction nice. with you? anybody in, in the business other than my editor. And so, you know, at the shows, I'll get to talk to maybe some of the other creators. Maybe meet for the first time or I've met through other shows. But, so it's always nice to chat with them and chat with the fans. Right. I know you've been doing this for a while. Think back though to the time that when you told your parents that you were going to be like a comic book artist. How did that conversation go? I always ask creators to get that reaction because it varies like from, you know, super supportive to, you know, we're going to have to move out of my house. Yeah, well, no, <laughs> my, I mean, my parents were always supportive of my artwork. I mean, because that's always. Well, what I excelled at, you know, even in grade school, I was like a you know, kid in the class that first started drawing three dimensions that were so restricted. And so, I mean, it, it was always just what I was here for. I, mean, I went to college on a talent grant at uh, Indiana State University up in Terre Haute, Indiana. And uh, so, I mean, they, they've always been supportive of, of my art work. Uh, just one funny thing is my grandparents used to buy them buy my comics, you know, we would go up to Rexall, which is the like corner grocery store, yeah. soda fountain where you get a milkshake, yeah. get comic books. Yeah, for like an hour. Yeah. Get all of them for an hour. And, uh, well, they were 25 cents even. <laughs> uh, and my grandpa, years later, you know, once I finally broke into comics and was doing, doing this as a living, he, he said to me one time, I never thought anything was going to come of you buying all those funny books. <laughs> Funny book. Hi, well, thanks, Grandpa. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Glad you had faith in me. Awesome. Hey, man, thank you very much for taking a couple yeah, minutes. My really pleasure. Do appreciate thank it. you. All right, thank, thank you. you. Awesome. Thank you.